Good morning, everybody. This is how awful I look in the morning. Probably not as bad as I look every other time, but yeah. So today I am filming a daily vlog. I don't know how long it's going to be, how short it's going to be, but we'll see. This is my first time f filming my day, but I have got a good couple of days coming up soon with Lauren and stuff, so I have some a lot of stuff to film and probably some bloopers to put on the end because we are going to be filming some videos on Thursday and it's now Tuesday. So I'm hoping to get this vlog up tomorrow, which is Wednesday, the film with Lauren on the Thursday. And then by the weekend, have a couple more videos up for you guys. So yeah, so uh, today I'm going to see some family. I don't know what I can film because I know my auntie and my cousin might not want to be on the camera, but we'll see. But I know my little godson, I can film bits of him and stuff because, yeah, he's four years old. And his name is Benjamin and he is adorable. So yeah, so you'll get to know him a little bit today, which would be nice. I don't really like to chat because, but what I do want to do is at one point sit and film a sit down video with him, asking him questions. I think that would be super, super cute because he's a little character. Yeah, because the way I'll describe him is, is an old man in a five-year-old's body. Is a perfect way to describe him. But yeah, so I'm just now chatting on, chatting on rubbish. I'm now trying to put my eyes up, but it is so windy. It's literally... Oh my God, I just freeze it. I just thought it was late. I arrived late on purpose. I just... Sorry. I have arrived here at 10 to just now to be seen. There's no five to. Yeah, oh, we're going to it. Um, so the next footage you're seeing now is just a cat, but this is just for me to tell you the next footage isn't going to make sense because I just started filming random little clips, so it is just little clips of my day. For example, the cat. Their cat is called Baloo, and it's an adorable cat. So yeah, so here's just a couple of clips of my day and my little godson, Benjamin. There he is, a little cutie, isn't he? But on the video. Benjamin, do a dance for me. I, I can't because I fell over. Oh no. Yeah? Should we do it? Yeah. Should we go on, on there now? Yeah, you might do that. When should we go on there? A different day, yeah? Why can't we go on it today? Oh, so a school day, is it? Oh. <sighs> what should you do? You crashed it. What was that? Don't go down. Don't go down where? I won't go downstairs. I said, I'm not going to wait here for you. Okay. Yeah? Playing with my dinosaurs. What? I'm going to play with the dinosaurs. Yeah. Yeah? Um, Bless you, it's so cute. Who's that? Me. Is it you? And who's that? Nathan. Can I have some different ones? That, 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 that. Little biscuits. Yeah. Love the biscuits. Love the biscuits, please. Yeah, well done. Goodbye. <laughs> what are you laughing at? But. <laughs> Picture of the 
Charlie, look. Show them. So kittens. Kittens? And then, what colour are the kittens? White. We've got a cat down there, haven't we? All white. Oh, look. from visiting my family and it was an absolutely lovely day but I didn't feel much I only filmed like little bits of me I'm a little godson because my other family didn't want to be on camera which is absolutely understandable because yeah because not everyone likes to be on camera but yeah but I had a great day so I have got the clips that you've just seen and stuff which is cute my little godson he's adorable I literally love him so much we had to be play some games had some dinner had an amazing uh, cottage pie oh delicious but yeah, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to set up my camera on the side and answer a few questions from my friends. Because what I've done is, because I knew I'm going to have a lot of footage for today, because it's probably only like about two minutes into this vlog. So I am going to set up my camera and answer a few questions from my friends that I asked. So yeah, so just a, qu a quick, quick little get to know me set kind of thing. So I'm just going to set up my camera and I'll be back to ask questions. Okay, so I have just popped you up. Probably look like absolute awful, but that's absolutely fine. The background's a mess, the light is probably awful, but I still, okay, it's just a little vlog. So, as, as I did just say, my friends did send me in some, I'm gonna say send me in, I messed them saying, some questions, vlog was really short today, need to fill in some time. So I asked my friends, my friends Lauren, Courtney and Chloe, I asked them to send some questions and they kindly did. The first question, starting off, nice and light, the first thing they said, what would your last meal on death row be? Oh, this is a tricky one. Very, very tricky. I have to say, so I'm, I'm going to go for a three-course meal. I'm going to say starter, my friend Chloe, her mum does the best turkey soup. And it's literally incredible. So that would be my starter, would be the turkey soup. And for the mains, it would have to be... Oh, a roast dinner but a gammon roast dinner that my cousin claire does she does literally an amazing amazing roast dinner with a vegetable oh with a roast potatoes the carrots the honey glazed carrots everything like that oh incredible and dessert i would say oh it's got to be nice chocolate fudge cake with some soaked lemon ice cream oh all oh, nice and gooey Oh, that would just be incredible. That'd be so good. Okay, so the next question is your celebrity crush. Oh, I have a few. <laughs> I have a few. The first obvious one is Tom Daly. Oh my God, he's the most gorgeous man ever. He's literally so gorgeous, so gorgeous. And oh, of course, Harry Styles. And his Harry Styles, just everything about him. His, just him, his fashion sense is incredible. His thoughts, his values, everything is just incredible. And also, I love a Tom, Tom Holland. And that's my man outfit. <sighs> Gets me going every single time. He's incredible. He's like a gorgeous human being, all of them together. So just me and him with them three. Yeah. Okay, so the next question is best TV show, film and show that I've seen recently. Let's start off with the best show. So the best musical, like the show, like theatre. I've seen recently was nine to five. I saw that recently. Oh my god, it was incredible. I saw Bonnie Langford and David Hasselhoff, and they were incredible. But Bonnie Langford did steal the show for me. She was incredible. She was literally so good. 
But yeah, so then a best TV show. I saw it's, it's a TV show called The Act. It's about, what's her name? Uh, it's, it's about Gypsy Rose Blanchard, about how she murdered her mum because her mother like pretended that she was ill her whole life and tricked everyone and the doctors and her thinking she was ill and there was nothing wrong with her. She basically abused her kid the whole life. But it's really, really dark and depressing, but it's so good. You must watch it. It's on Hulu. But yeah, but I got the five day free trial and got rid of it to watch it. But yeah, and then favourite film as well. Oh, I don't know, but it's, it says recently. This is, this is only like recently. Favourite film. Ugh. I don't really watch films. I don't really like films. Um, oh, I don't know. I think they've got one, not a recent one. Oh, what's the most recent film? Last time I saw it in the cinema was It. Oh, that's quite good, actually. So it was quite good. Cause I don't really like the horror gory stuff, the well, scary stuff. But recently, I've been getting really into it. Like, so into it. So, yeah. Probably it's the most recent thing I've seen. And the next question was, what do I do for a living? So I'm an entertainer on Holiday Parks. And I'm just going into my fifth season. So I'm going to be moving away. Well, away. I am quite local this year. I'm still in Essex, my hometown. So I'll be moving up the road about a 40 minute drive up the road. So that's not too far. But yeah, I'll be living it on my own at least. So it's a good thing. I'll be having a caravan to myself this year. Because normally you share accommodation, but this year I don't. So exciting. So I've got my own caravan to myself. So I'll be able to decorate it. And I'll have some better backgrounds than my small little room here. So there'll be better videos, more content coming out for you guys. So yeah, so I, uh, yeah, so I am entertaining at Autonomy Parks. That is my job. I am like, it's like a blue coat, red coat kind of style. But we're pink coats, obviously. Because it's not that company. It's like, because... Like each company has a different colour with pink, so I'm a pink coat on holiday park. Oh, yeah. The next one's a good question. If you won the lottery, what would you do with the money? Oh, I always know this. The first thing I've always said, I would buy a theatre in London and just just buy that and run it. Because that's always what, what, what I wanted to do. Because then just to see the shows and the shows, I just want to go see shows and be in shows and do stuff with that. So I would buy... A theatre in London. Ideally, one like the Savoy, the Dominion, or oh, the Royal Opera House, anything like that, or oh, the Apollo, anything, just any of the big theatres, even like Sir Edward, or even something like outside of London, but still in London, like the new Wimbledon Theatre, something like that. Just one that, oh, just depends how much money I, I, I would win for the lottery, but if I won the millions, I would buy a theatre and run, well, not run it myself, like, one handedly, but own the building, own it. So now I choose what shows can put there. Oh, yeah, that would be a dream of mine. Yeah, and I can force myself to be in the shows. Way <laughs> no, they'll get no views because I'm absolutely rubbish. But oh well. So the next one is favorite RuPaul Drag Race Queen and season. This is hard. See, because I know my favorite season, but it's very, very, very controversial. So my favorite season is season seven. But when I heard when they were saying in an All Stars, I can't remember which one it was, but they were saying hope there's no queens from season seven because that was the season that just like dive into the ground it was my favourite because I, I think it was because it was the first one I, that I ever watched so I watched it from season 7 like and then watched 7, 8, 9 because that's what was out at the time no it was just 7, 8 I watched 7, 8 and then went back and watched them all and then 9 come out so I watched them a bit weird I watched 7, 8 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 9 and then so on and then all the all stars in between as well the order they were in so yeah, so seven, it's just got some great people in it. Like, but if you look at about it, they say, yeah, it was died. But then, look who's actually in it. There's some Iconics. And their favourite actual queen. <sighs> That's so hard. I would say, I'm going to do top three, because I can, my channel. Sorry, Courtney, who asked the question. Uh, I'm doing top three. <sighs> Courtney Act. Jinx Monsoon. Seen her live twice. She's incredible. Her voice is stunning. Um, Courtney Act Jinx Monsoon. It's between two. It's between Bianca and Willem. I mean, they've got so many others as well. I'm going to say both. So Bianca and Willem as well. Literally incredible. But then I do almost a, a special mention the the pearls, the milks. Oh, the, oh my God, I forgot about the fucking UK season, didn't I? Oh, the UK set, but I'm going to class that as separate. My favourite UK one, Blue Hydrangea, Ranger, Back of Chips, top two. Should have won. One of them should have won. Just saying. Just saying. Just saying.
just saying. But yeah, but that is the last question that I'm going to answer. There was a couple more, but I could save them for another video. Because, say, for example, I'll do another Q&A one time. I've not got enough questions from you guys. I can add them into it to bulk it up. So I'll also have them on the back burner. But yeah, so that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. It's a bit of a vlog and a little chatty Q&A afterwards. I hope you enjoyed it. So, but if not, I will see you next time. See you later. Bye.